Holy... <sighs> Bruh. Let's go, dude. Yep, P500 lobby. P500 lobby. Literally maxed out. <laughs> Please. They were gonna send us to Azeroth's. I would have actually rather have gone there. Okay, Haddon feels a good one. I was worried it was gonna be eerie or uh, something like that. Welcome in, Nuggies. Yes. The ultimate game of DVD here. Let's see how it's played. No signs of life at the beginning. Here we go. Self-aware sprint burst. Unfortunate. Strong build. Potentially meta build for Survivor right now. Self-aware vigil sprint burst and a fourth perk. But we still managed to get the fourth, uh, the first hit here. We're just gonna walk out this pallet. A really strong central pallet. I see somebody's aura. Undying is revealed to him. We're gonna teleport. Prevent him from um, cleansing this totem. Oh, he's already spooked. Let's teleport again. Force some people off of Jin's now that we have faced the darkness. Cool, we know Nia's there too. Manifest mind game right here. She falls prey to it. <laughs> Lovely. Then we're gonna teleport to Nia. The game has begun. Bill's cleansing that totem again. Uh, TP on a churl for another stack here. Uh, let's go get Pentimento. There goes Undying. D manifest before we pick it. Give Bill a stack here. Yo, what's up, Sugar Pie? No, yes. Nice. There's a stack on a Bill. Screams over there. We've teleported a lot. We need to reset a hit onto Nia here. Going for the totem. Churl's also sticking her gin. She doesn't want Rune regressing it. It should be a free hit. No dead hard. Now the scream on the bill. We're gonna ignore Nia. We have ring drawing, so if she heals, it'll spread condemn. Give a stack on the bill. Prevent him from um, getting this totem. Claude's still injured here. Our face of darkness target. I'm gonna teleport over here. Make sure Claude's not on our totem. What is Claude doing? She's the only one we're not getting screams with. Nia should be picking up here. Why not wait for 5 gen Penty? Because it's really risky. It's really risky. We get a scream on Bill trying to cleanse this totem. That's too risky. The one stack to basically cause 30% gen slow is really nice when combining with Ruin. It makes Ruin so much stronger. We're gonna teleport again. Just constantly backing, um, bouncing back and forth between these three targets. Hopefully get a reset on Nia here. There's Claude who popped her gin. Mm, Bill might get a totem here. Yo, Media with the two gifted subs. Thank you, dude. See, is Claude going to... Nice, Bill screamed again, canceling the totem cleanse. Now we reset some TVs here. Six. Seven. Dang. It was just at the brink of eight seconds. Not able to reset TVs here. Multiple screams in the back. No pallet here for Bill. They cleanse the totem. Which one was it? I believe it was Face of Darkness. So Face of Darkness is going to be down. No more screams. We still have Ruin and Pentimento though. They're screaming because of Face of Darkness, but it was just cleansed. Now it's gonna take them 30% more to heal. 30% longer, rather, to heal too. She's trying to warn her. Nice, we've done this trail multiple times. Bill and Claude are healing, spreading condemned to each other with ring drawing. I believe they were down relative over here. The story behind the sign, yes, that was when I was basically advertising on YouTube that I was making the swap to Twitch. Um, we used to stream on YouTube, and so I, I went out and I did a live stream just sitting there holding a sign for 30 minutes, and boy, oh boy, dude, I almost passed out. 
Bill still really wants this totem. Uh, Legion, definitely. Legion, definitely for that. Nice, we reset our TVs. Multiple targets down on the ground. Uh, let's check the totem out here. We have three totems available right now. We've checked the, these two right here. Uh, they pick up Cheryl, so we're gonna teleport, get a double stack of Condemn. No, it was the guy. No, he was actually being extremely generous. Oh, she's trying to greet the gen. There's a sprint first. He was being extremely generous and he didn't know what Twitch was, so he was like trying to offer me some change. Nice. That's a good down on Claude. Going to pick a Bill over here. We should get another stack. Did I main before Onryo? Heartbeat. Hello. Honestly, I mained a bunch of killers. Doc and Spirit, I'd say, are my second and third most main. We're just gonna bloodlust this chase. No pallets nearby except for this one out here. I'm gonna pretend I'm going that way. No camp, that's fine. Bloodlust tier two now. Um, but yeah, Wraith could run this build for sure. We only lose one rank of Bloodlust for kicking that. They get another totem, but we're about to get our kill here. At three gins, four P100s. First P100 to Mori slash DC. Big. Uh, Charles picked up a tape by the totem in the back. We're gonna hold on to our teleport here. Haddonfield has a really, really good line of sight. We're gonna see which way she's going. If she's not going this way to the right, then we flick to the left. It can't be that TV. It's probably this one. No information though. Crow just came back over there. Maybe Cheryl is greeting the Jin. They get another Pentimento. We're down to one perk right now. Yes, they are greeting the Jin. I'd rather down Claudette here. She has Sprint Burst. Actually, now that Claude sprinted, we'll go for Cheryl. Mm, this is not the best loop. We're just gonna have to work out this pallet. Unless... No, she gets it. Yeah, we basically confirmed that she was on the Jin because we, she didn't go to the right or the left. Does she make this pallet? I think she does. Life. That's her exhaustion of choice. She is trying to put it up here. It is a longer tape animation, so this is her TV. They broke the totem over here. Let's see if they're still nearby working on the gin. Also, Bill was over here. Let's see if he's on this one. We have all our TVs available. They end up popping that gin, that's fine. We still have Ruin. Maybe we could have saved that gen with Ruin, but honestly, we've already done so much damage. Jolt with Deadmans? Yeah, that would be really good if people are trying to greed to Jin. Does she run in here? Then we get a stack. Bill's gonna need to come off his gen. He might want to commit for Ruin. He does commit. Good idea, actually. Because Cheryl has a lot of time left. Um, now we need to reset some TVs, though. Claude and Bill both have really high Condemn, and somebody's gonna have to spread Condemn by picking up Cheryl. Demanifest before I kick the pallet so that we have the option to teleport over to Cheryl. Claude's going for the tape first, we can see. So we're gonna cancel that. Nice. We don't want her picking up the tape there. Because if she picks up the tape, it allows Cheryl to put hers up safely, since we're not able to cut her off of the teleport. And now we kind of repeat that process. We look for Bill, and um, if Bill goes to pick up, we teleport. 
We just make sure that he's not picking up the tape. Yes, it was a GG. He does pick her up. We should get another Mori here. No pallet, no life. Wee. Oh, baby, a triple. Good luck, Bill. May the hatch be with you, dude. He's all the way over here by this TV. No, he's running through. Dude, quad Mori on quad P100s? That would be pretty nice. Let's see if he gets lucky with Hatch. He doesn't! No dead heart, no luck, no Hatch. Only goo! Let's go, dude! Uh. <laughs> G G. One for the books. Wow. One for the books.